Hey guys, welcome back to Adventures of Well I Mean. Today we're going to be continuing our Museum of Gaming A to Z for the Nintendo 64. Today we are playing Body Harvest. Don't know anything about this game, so let's pretty much jump straight into it, see what it's like, give it a rating out of 10, and yeah, give you an honest review. I'm trying to work out if it's, like, alien abduction. When I heard body harvest, I just automatically thought of, like... Like, asylums and stuff, and you're, like, killing people. But I don't know if that's it. Station Omega, Earth Orbit. 2016. The Earth lies in ruins. Over the past 100 years, a vast alien invasion has harvested mankind to the brink of extinction. High above the dead planet. The last survivors hatch a desperate plan to halt the invasion at key points in the Earth's past. A prototype time travel vehicle is ready. Its crew, a team of genetically enhanced soldiers, is being prepared. But time has run out. The aliens have returned. Guys. This year, how weird is that? 2016. Oh, <laughs> and they're hungry. How weird is that though? The fact that I'm playing a game where they said it in the future and it's now that time. Like, that just. That's mind boggling to me. That looks like an interesting ship. Um. Don't freeze. Don't freeze. I'm gonna jump cut this. I'm gonna get it back into the game. So, here we go guys. Sorry about that. I'm not sure why it froze like that, but we'll just deal with it. Enter name. I'm gonna use my actual name. <laughs> Apparently I'm not. Let's use my actual name. I thought pressing start would actually take it to that part. Hero or zero? I'm gonna do hero. What are you gonna do hero? Demo options. Demo? That's weird. Alright. Alpha One. Here we go. So we missed a bit of backstory with all that. Mission directive. Let's see if we can find out what's been happening here. Try the village ahead. Check your map to fix your position. I just realized I should turn the volume down on this a bit. <laughs> and remember, I'm always here for you in Alpha Command. Good luck. Um. Cool, so you can target with Z and then pew, pew, shoot with the R button, is that what I'm pressing? Yep. No new info, previous messages followed, okay. That was an accident, pressing buttons like that. Run towards the vehicle and press bottom C button to take control of it. Ooh. This is cool. Uh, warning. I'm detecting a huge energy surge nearby. This could be our first contact with the enemy. Get ready! This actually doesn't seem too bad, guys. Except there's something there. Die! Yeah, that was actually not too bad for like the first part of the game. Okay, what do we do now? As the car moves by itself. Caution drawbridge ahead to cross C Tollmaster. 
who is over here, maybe? Um, no, that's not supposed to happen. Um, oh, okay, we can go in rooms. Hey, what was all that rumpus outside? You look like you must have been sent to help us. I suppose you want to crush my bridge now. Pull the lever on the wall behind me. Okay. The only thing that's a little bit annoying is our character is a bit slow to like respond. Like whenever you press buttons, it's it's just a bit awkward, the timing. It's not the worst game I've played in terms of uh, like slow characters and delayed responses, but it definitely doesn't help a game at all when it's like that. Jump in the car. Drive away. Fly over the bridge because for some reason the game does that. Yeah, that's a bit weird that it just like, you just go through things all of a sudden. And I'm not sure if that's like a progra programming error or just some glitch that's occurring now that I'm playing it. I want to get in this one. No, it's locked. Come on, there we go. <laughs> oh, don't know why I was concentrating so hard there. Oh, wrong button, wrong button. Get in, get in, get in. Come on, there we go, there we go, come on. Okay, got that guy. Uh, ooh, whoa. That was weird, jelly stuff. Oh, they're destroying this like crazy, and I'm just. I'm just taking my sweet time. Come on. There we go. Yeah. Destroy. Um, you're going down too. Yeah. There we go. Oh, I just ran over that guy. Oh, no. That's not good. I didn't mean to do that. I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going. That is also a problem. I'm assuming if I read the signs, it will tell me. That's, yeah, again, just awkward. Danger shield drop, please. Exercise extreme caution when close to the cliff edge. Okay. Are we not supposed to go that way? Oh, let's go this way. Let's check this way out. I feel like... I missed something this way. I am not 100% sure. It's a little bit weird. Let's go this way. This way. Let's just follow this road. Maybe that will take us somewhere that we need to go. I'm not sure. And the game glitched out again. Oh, that was me hitting buttons. Um. Okay. I'm assuming that hasn't saved anything because, you know, that's what happens in games. Yeah. That hasn't. Okay. In that case, I'm going to end this here, guys. Um, that was a little bit disappointing. Um, I don't know, rating out of 10. Oh, I won't give it, like, a bad rating as such because it wasn't that bad. The controls being kind of slow did kind of uh, ruin it a bit, um, but I might give it a 5.5 .5 out of 10. It had some good promise to it, and I'd play it again if I knew it wasn't going to crash like that, um, if there was a way to fix it. 
Oh, that would be great. Uh, but again, that's probably just the emulation. Uh, yeah, so 5.5 5 out of 10, I would probably play that again. Just to see if I could get past that. But yeah, the sluggish controls is what kind of ruined it as well for the actual gameplay. Music was good. Storyline seemed good. Um, yeah. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, check back tomorrow. What are we going to be playing? What are we going to be playing? That is a good question. We're going to be playing Bomberman 64. Bomberman 64. This is going to be awesome. Cannot wait for it, guys. I'll catch you then. Have a good one. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. If you want to check out the previous video for this series, click the top left video. If you want to check out my favourite videos from my own playlists, check out the bottom one where I've compiled them all together for you to check out. And if you're not subscribed, you can hit my logo up in the top right to subscribe. Again, thank you so much and I'll catch you next time.